We just got our hands on the preliminary water quality test results for Coffee Pot Bayou. Dozens of dead and sick pelicans have been found near the bayou and in several waterways around St. Pete. Jamel and A joins us now live from the Coffee Pot Bayou where one dead bird was found just today. Jamel, what do these results say? Well, the results there for Coffee Pot Bayou as well as the Riviera Bay area. And we've been told that the water here at Coffee Pot Bayou tested just fine. Now, so far, officials say they found at least 15 dead pelicans and they just don't know what's killing them. Deanne Cardine Camlider took these pictures of a dead pelican at Coffee Pot Bayou Sunday. And I was looking at the island and then I just looked down and there was one there just in front of me. She said other pelicans didn't look so well either. Over the weekend, rescue groups took in more than 30 sick pelicans. We got a call saying that we had to get down there. There were bodies in the water. There was uh, pelicans drowning. So far, city crews have collected 15 dead pelicans around Riviera Bay Neighborhood Lake and Coffee Pot Bayou. St. Pete officials say it's a mystery what's causing them to get sick and die. Some speculate a large fish kill from last week might be the culprit. We're hiring um, a consulting uh, firm to look at the water quality, develop an investigation, and perhaps even if they can find any of the, the dead fish, maybe do some toxicology on, on those dead fish if there are any um, still present. But they've ruled out wastewater discharges. The likelihood is, is so low, I, I, I hazard to even comment what it could be. Uh, there's, you know, when you have a flushing system like this, uh, anything that, that could have been here has been gone for so many months now um, that any correlation would would be wild speculation not based on any science that I've ever seen. Now officials went around the bayou and the lake area and they started putting up these signs and again they are going to uh, continue to do these testing uh, around these areas. Jen? Well do authorities believe whatever was making the birds sick is no longer a threat? Yeah, you know, they came out here today and they surveyed several pelicans or the whole colony that's over on the, on the Bird Island over there. And they said that these birds, whatever was stressing them out, looks to be gone. So they think these birds are on the point of recovery at this point. Jen? The worst is over, we hope. Jamel Linnae reporting live for us tonight. Thank you.